Greetings! If you're watching this video, then you're probably considering buying this uh, USB power pack. As is often the case, I received this product free for the purpose of review, but despite that, I will be completely candid because I shop on Amazon the same way you do. Um, so uh, basically, I'm just going to demonstrate the uh, demonstrate the charging the item. I'm charging from the item. I haven't uh, pre-tested this, so I have no idea how it's going to turn out. You'll know when I do. Um, my initial take, though, is that uh, it's a fairly attractive case. I mean, a lot of them are just sort of a plain black um, mat, but this is fairly attractive. So I have uh, before me an iPad Air, which wants um, two amps. Let's see if this charging uh, unit will give it to us. Uh, worth noting that uh, the pushing the button is mandatory. It's also got these cool lights on the side, which I'm guessing just waste uh, battery power. But let's see how this responds. All right, it's uh, it's charging at uh, 2.12 uh, amps, which is pretty sufficient. A little bit of hiccup. I think there's a hiccup in this cable because it's very sensitive to movement. I don't think it's the charger. I think it's the cable. Um, okay, two, 205. So th this is more than sufficient for the iPad. Let's uh, let's connect a second item to the other port and see how that does. It uh, it's an iPhone. It wants uh, it wants one amp. So let's watch the power. Let's let it stabilize a bit here first. Okay, two point one three amps and second power draw. Phone is charging. iPad is charging. No change of output on the iPad. So I consider that pretty solid. Um, so I, I have no reason to, to doubt this. But my only concern is that it, they've gone to a lot of trouble to make this attractive. It's got the, these LEDs on the side that are constantly changing color. That seems a bit excessive. I, I, I like an attractive, attractive device, but I'm not sure I need one that's going to cycle through colors just for the heck of it. Um, and another note that, that we saw some initial sort of back and forth uh, with the cable um, on the output to the iPad, it's stabilized, so it's fine. It's just a, apparently a problem with the with the setup initially. So all seems fine. Um, just seems a little bit unnecessarily gaudy to me. Um, I like the case. I just don't need color cycling LEDs because I mean, on some level you paid for those. So do you really care enough to to pay for that? So anyway, I hope that's helpful. Um, if it's not, leave me a comment. Let me know what else you'd like to know. And until next time, happy shopping.